Hi there! I'm Jody. Welcome to another episode of Freaky Funky Foods. I'm joined by... Just kidding, guys. It's me, Brett. I'm not really a cat. Uh, yes, another episode of Freaky Funky Foods, and we've got something, uh... Ooh, Delali, this looks a little bit sweet. Uh, but you know what? I'm willing to give it a whirl. This is Kit Kat with fruity cereal in it. Fruit Loops. But well, not legally allowed Trademark to call them. Trademark purposes, we yeah. can't say that. So, yeah, and it's limited edition. It's in a lovely pink package here. And you know what? Uh, well, before we get to that, let's uh, read Wait, some instructions. the real question is, do you like Kit Kats? I do like Kit Kats. I love Kit Kats. But I like the chocolate of the uh, Kit Kat. So. Have you tried the mint ones or the mocha ones? I do like the mocha ones, the mint ones. I'm not really a big fan of mint and chocolate together because it's like I'm brushing my teeth with a Hershey bar. I have pretty much enjoyed all versions of Kit Kat, including the key lime pie. That one wasn't bad. It was different, but I like them when I got into a Kit Kat, I want some good chocolatiness. And this is not chocolatey. I bet it's at, white chocolate. Let's look at the, what do you think the first ingredient is? Sugar. Ding, ding, sugar, Yee! vegetable ding. oil, palm oil, shea oil, lots of oils, lactose, uh, da, 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 a bunch of stuff I can't pronounce. Oh, here we get to the colors. Uh, red 40 lake, yellow 6, yellow 5, red 40, blue 1. Oh, shout out to Dave. It has yellow 5. That's right. It contains milk, wheat, soy, and I think your cat's at the door trying to get in. Probably. Nope, she's right there trying to get out. Oh. <laughs> oh. My, my cat has decided to join us. Her name is Arrow, and she's super cute. I post a lot of pictures. All right, and this, oh, this is uh, by the Hershey Company. I did not know that. Yeah. All right. Well, shall we open it up, give it a sniff? You think you're going to like it? it's going to smell it's like It's going to smell like Fruity Pub. I hope it smells like Fruit Loops or Fruity Pub. Oh, it's pink. Oh, it is pink. I expect it to be like white chocolate. Hold that shit up for the camera. Oh, that is. Oh, it's got like sprinkles in it. Go closer. Ooh, it's, it's freckled. All right, I'll take one. You take one. Oh, or you take two. I take no, two. No, I didn't mean to take two. Okay, I, I was gonna say I don't want to. All right, sniff. My poor cat. Oh, it smells fruity. It smells sugary. It smells fruity too. Fruity and sugary. My Hold on, cat. kitty. Jeez, I love you, um. All right, I'll do the <laughs> countdown since we're doing everything bass backwards. Are you gonna dip that in your beer? I'm, I might. <laughs> okay. It's melty. Hurry up. Three, two, one. Oh, go for a half. It tastes like Fruit Loops. It does. It's actually not bad. <laughs> no. It tastes. This it is really good. <clears throat> I apologize for the excessive cat meowing in the background. It's not me this time. No, not with the pillow. No, you're not kitty face this anymore. This is actually, surprisingly, really good. Kind of sweet, mm. but not overly sweet like the Swedish Fish Marshmallows. If you don't oh, know what we're terrible. talking about, go back a couple episodes, you'll get it. Oh, those were absolutely awful. They were so sweet. This is actually tolerable. And it does have that breakfasty taste too. <laughs> it kinda so does. You probably like shouldn't the milk eat. With the yeah, you loops. probably shouldn't eat this uh, to start your day. But you know, in a pinch, mm. it's uh, no, it's actually not bad. Oh, no. we, what? What? Uh, did you bring the sporks? Oh shit! No. Nope. Oh shit! All right, we're gonna have to go with thumbs, I, mean, I guess. He could run out and actually let the cat out. You're gonna, you're them? really gonna entertain these people for that long. I can try. Where are the sports? Oh, the kitchen. On top of the little fridge. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna try to knock over the, try not to knock over the camera. I'll be right back. Everybody. He's letting the cat out. The poor thing. I didn't realize she was locked in the room. But no, I do have to say, surprisingly, these are pretty damn good. And I'm not a fan of super sweet stuff. I don't eat a lot of sugar in my diet, or at least I try not to. So, yeah, kind of impressed. All right, your dumb cat almost ran right back in here. Well, of course she did. She's not the brightest crayon, but okay. she's still cute. All right, well, I think it's... Hold on, let me... I think it's pretty go. damn obvious. Pretty obvious. I'm going spork up with this. Would I be able to eat, like, a, you know, extra large pack of these? 
probably not because they're too sweet, but this size pack with like the four breakable pieces, I could I could eat that. I could break off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. I could too. Mmm, quite that was delicious. delicious. And this was an impulse buy. We found these at Walmart in Waterville. So this was an impulse buy. So sometimes impulse buys are good. True story. All right, well, that's our episode. Oh, you know what? Since we're doing everything backwards, how about you take us out? <gasps> Great. Comment, share, subscribe. Share. <laughs> okay, stop. Um, tell a friend. Tell your neighbor. Uh, tell your neighbor's friend. Fucking post this shit on Facebook. Yes. Share our post. That's how things get spread, you know. Like herpes. Not that it's gonna. <laughs> yes, just like herpes. <laughs> the clap. Gonna be it. Wait, nope, tangent. Not gonna go there. Anywho, do all that fun stuff, and we will see you next time on Freaky Funky Foods. See ya. <laughs>